Hi, I'm Gardner Comfort. I'm an actor and a writer, and I was born with Tourette syndrome. Tourette syndrome is a neurological disorder that you're born with. It makes you have these uncontrollable tics, movements, or sounds. Usually it goes away in your 20s, which for me it didn't. It was really hard as a kid. My mom would tell me that I would tick on the subway and immediately look around to see who was looking at me, and unfortunately I still do that but now I know I can actually vocalize and explain it. In high school, I found acting. I really discovered that I had this talent for the theater um, and for dance, and I was the star in a lot of high school plays. On stage, I feel completely free. Yeah, the show, The Elephant in Every Room I Enter, is um, my story of having Tourette Syndrome, and uh, specifically going to the 2014 National Conference of the Tourette's Association of America down in Washington, D.C. It's extraordinary to be in these giant conference rooms and hear these constant eruptions of chirps, barks, disgusting coughs like mine, echoed words, conference, advocate, we're so happy, happy, happy to have you. <laughs> For the first time in my life, it was actually normal to have Tourette's. <laughs> Building a show with Kel has been a really exciting process. We've put together this absolutely crazy show that is a really, really, I think, entertaining and exciting story. You seem pretty well adjusted. You don't seem to have a lot of ticks. He's like, oh, wait, you just missed it. I was at an episode about 15 minutes ago. I was just grabbing someone and I couldn't let go. <laughs> yeah, that's my tick. What I do is I grab people and I bear hug them and I can't let go. <laughs> we need your help to raise $20,000 produce the world premiere of The Elephant in Every Room I Enter at La Mama, October 15th to November 1st. It's important to both of us that we compensate our collaborators as fairly as possible. That includes our choreographer, our associate director, our designers, our stage managers, and technicians. We also have the additional costs of a press rep, photographer, videographers, and other marketing and advertising costs to get as many people as possible to see our show. This show is extremely important for those living with Tourette syndrome, as well as the special needs community at large. I remember doing the workshop production of this show last year, and I loved hearing people in the audience ticking as they watched the show. I felt like I was doing it specifically for them, especially when they were young people. I feel like my job in performing this show is to do it as much as possible, so that people living with Tourette syndrome understand that they're not alone. Thank you for being a part of our show. Your contribution and support makes this all possible.